So how long have you been married now? 36 years. Wow. Congratulations. <laughs> so you must have some really good tips for getting over arguments, difficult times. What, what are your top three? I, I do think we pass through a period of time in which people, and some of my divorced friends would agree with me on this, pulled the plug too quickly. Um, I think it was a period of time during which we had incredibly high expectations of marriage. I, I mean, my grandmother did not expect my grandfather to be her best friend. She had a best friend, right. had had since sixth grade. Mm. He had a different role in her life, and, and I think she did not expect him to be all in all. And we went through a period in which we expected the spouse to be all in all. Mm. I think that's a foolish expectation. Mm -hmm. I think your world should be bigger yes. than just your husband mm -hmm. or your wife. Mm -hmm. um, I think you've got to be a united front for your children. That was really hard yeah. sometimes, yeah. but we really managed to do it. Um, if so we had, what would you say if they were trying to conquer, divide and conquer? Don't try to pull that on me. No. You're, you already talked to your dad about this. Right. You know how this goes. And sometimes when it was an issue where we did disagree, we blue sky at first before we sat down with the kids. Mm -hmm. um, I, I can't possibly overestimate the importance of family meals. I know that sounds so, so silly, hard. but um, we're, having fa we're having family dinner tonight, even though um, the people we're having it with are 30, 28 and unfortunately Maria's in Los Angeles, so we're missing 25 tonight. Um, but I think a lot gets hashed over um, at family dinners. 